Good afternoon and welcome to another vlog. And we're here in Exton this afternoon near Chorley in Lancashire. And I thought we'd try this place out now. This is Skippers of Exton. It's an award-winning chippy. So uh, beginning of August 2024, let's get in and let's check out these fish and chips. Hey up, I need to tell you how much this little lot's gonna cost, don't I? So for a lunchtime special, that's haddock and chips, it was 7 50 the peas were £1.35 and the curry sauce was £1.35 as well. And that came to a grand total of £10.20. And it's mid-August, it's not the beginning of August either. But uh, anyway, let me know whether you think it's good value or not in the comments. Now then, I've got the goods and let's check these out. So, as I say, haddock and chips. Ta-da! So that's your, uh, quite a big piece of fish that, to be fair. We do the old uh, palm test. So a fairly big piece of fish. And there are your chips underneath. So I'll just move that to one side. And if I can, bear with me. I can uh, fight my way into a paper bag. Let's have a look at these. So these are... As you can tell, I hope they are anyway. There are your mushy peas. And this is your curry sauce. And I was offered the choice of hot curry sauce or mild curry sauce. So I went for mild. And that's what that looks like. So we'll, uh, we'll get into this little lot in a sec. So first of all, let's check out one of these chips. If I can get that to focus. So let's try that. Yeah, very good. Nice and hot. And freshly cooked. Plenty of salt and vinegar on them as well. Which is always good. Next, let's check out these mushy peas. Consistency is good. Not like a soup. Let's check them out. Yep, yeah. they're good as well. Nice, uh, nice flavouring to them. Salted as well, which is uh, what I like. And then next, let's check out this curry sauce. So as I was saying, this is mild curry sauce. This didn't want to get the uh, didn't want to get the stuff that's too hot. I've not got any uh, bog rolls in freezer for that. So, yeah, good curry sauce that. Nice tang to it, bit of a bite, but not over the top. Yeah, all good so far, and we'll get into this fish in uh, in a second. So let's check out this fish. Let's break into that. Now this was freshly cooked. This that looks decent. Oh. Excuse me, got a bit of chip stuck in my throat there. Looks decent, does that. Nice and hot. Yeah. I don't know whether you can hear the crunch or not. But that got a... a really nice crunch to it. And like I said, decent piece of fish, that. And nice batter. So I'll get back to you very soon. Just to get back to you as well with this uh, this piece of haddock. Crikey, there's some weight in that as well. Decent piece of fish that, for that kind of money. And like I said, it's uh, it has got some weight to it as that. It's like a casing batter. Now casings aren't my favourite, but this, this is very nice actually, crack it's hot, hot to touch that. The uh, the batter's really tasty. And it's uh it's skinless as well, which is which is what I like. Crack it's hot that. Like a nuclear reactor that. But yeah, decent piece of fish and tasty. 
taste good quality does that so as you can see they've uh, they've been devoured now as a collective we'll go through them the mushy peas were good um, add some taste to them nicely salted not a soup which isn't good the curry sauce I thought was really good um, nice bite to it a bit of a tang it wasn't the as I say it wasn't the um, it wasn't the spicy version but then again I didn't want the spicy version so yeah that was good as well chips were good uh, decent sized portion as well nice and golden on the outside fluffy on the in uh, the fish massive piece of fish to be fair for that kind of money big piece of addict that it was a casing batter which if I'm honest I'm not overly keen on if I had a preference it wouldn't be a casing but you know what that was really tasty that um, it wasn't uh, it wasn't too thick the batter and uh, really heavy piece of fish which you don't see these days a lot of it steamrolled as I've said on uh, on some of my other vlogs so yeah all in all very nice that um, staff were pleasant as well uh, lady that served me uh, she told me about the lunchtime special which was the uh, the fish and chips and the uh, the sides were obviously extra so the fish and chips were 750 uh, the shop was nice and clean as well uh, there was a lady who came out uh, not long after I'd been served to clean the uh, the cabinets and what have you so yeah marks out of 10 I know I'm waffling marks out of 10 I'm going to give them a 9.4 out of 10 as a collective so well worth a try if you're ever in uh, in Exton or Shawley or uh, in this part of Lancashire now I do have to admit as well it's uh, it's actually mid-August it's not the beginning of August the uh, the days and months are just passing by so if I can just manage to get up from here I'll just show you where I am so yeah it's like a shopping complex if you will we'll just walk around actually I'll show you where we are so it's just off the uh, the main road it's like a little shopping area and the chippy which is closed now is just up there so if I just pan round nice weather for uh, for ducks so all that remains for me to say is please join me again on my next adventure wherever that may be like we are here in uh, rainy UK or elsewhere around the world so thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon